Hey, we're going to talk about Boston Whisker Plots. And a Boston Whisker Plot, uh, the first thing you need to do is find the median. So, in order to find the median, we need to put these numbers in order from least to greatest. So, I have two ones, one, one. I'm going to cross these out as I go just to help me. And then I have two threes. And then a four, a five. A six, a seven, and last an eight. So I got these or in order from least to greatest. And so let's find my median. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine numbers. So the middle number is going to be my fifth number, which is the number four. So my median is four. Now you're going to hear some turns um, finding Boston Whisker plot um, that are new. Well. First, let's write down my median. Median is 5. And then you're going to hear the terms uh, lower and upper quartile. You may ask her first quartile and third quartile. Same thing. And all that means is that we're taking the word quartile, and if you look, the prefix to that is core, like in quarter or quart, and it means dividing this up into fours. So once I have my median, now I have two sets of data. I have a lower set here in white and an upper set in this red box. So my lower quartile what I'm going to do is find the median of that yellow or that white box. So look at my middle numbers. I have two middle numbers of one and three. So the median of one and three would be two. Halfway between one and three is two. And then do the same thing for my upper quartile. So my two middle numbers there are six and seven. So halfway between six and seven would be six and a half. So that is the box part of my um, box and whisker plot. And then to find the last two things I need is my min and my max. So my minimum number is 1 and my maximum is 8. Alright, so now we're ready to draw our box and whisker plot. So where the median is, is where you're going to draw a line. So our median is 5, so I'm going to draw a line at 5. And then at the lower and upper quartiles, I'm also going to draw a line. So I'm going to have a line at 2 and a line at 6.5. So these form the edges of my box, the lower and upper quartiles. And then that's the box part of a box and whisker. And then the whisker part are the min and max. So my max is 8, I'm going to put a dot, and my min and min value is 1, so I'm going to put a dot there, and then connect my dots to my box. So I have a box with whiskers. So just to recap, your median is of the whole set of data, that's the middle number, that's that middle blue line, and then your lower and upper quartiles are also lines forming the box, and those are the median of the lower half of the data, and the medium of the upper half of the data, and then your minimum and maximum values are your whiskers.